My name is Dave Boyle. I'm the general manager at Chandler's Prime Steaks Fine Seafood. Chandler's, we are a classic steakhouse menu. Uh, and we like to take that concept and elevate it a bit, so specialty steaks. Uh, Boise's culinary scene is unique because uh, you bring together the farm to table, a lot of local produce, uh, local cheeses, uh, local butchers. So if I had to convince a friend to come to Chandler's uh, in two sentences, I would say uh, cold martinis, live jazz, world-class service, prime steaks, Jet Fresh Seafood. You know, this is a dining experience. My name is Brian Garrett. I am the uh, proprietor of St. Lord's Gridiron. St. Lord's Gridiron, we, we like to say we're exploring the roots of American cuisine. We really focus on delicious first. Everything we do, we try to make absolutely delicious. And uh, people always really go for our shrimp and grits, which is like kind of a, a staple, but uh, people love it. What we focus on for the bar program is essentially kind of coming off of what we do for food, which is exploring you know, the roots of American cuisine. We go back to look at pre-prohibition era cocktails, and then we like to move them in a slant, you know, like something that we have to say about each cocktail. We try to, we try to be unique and interesting, but delicious first. And we're really proud of what we do, and we really think uh, that we're offering something um, that people will enjoy. My name is Rodney Johnson. I'm the general manager for Olivita. At Olivita, we most certainly specialize in Italian cuisine. The Boise culinary scene is quite unique from the standpoint of how many amazing chefs are out here in such an unexpected location. Certainly, our crowd favorite dessert here at Olivita is our salted caramel vanilla budino. Our bar here at Olivita is unique because we have an amazing master mixologist here. If I needed to convince someone to come dine here at Olivita, I would have to let them know that. Uh, We've had folks visit, whether they be locals or from all across the country and world, and say that even though they've had Italian food in Italy, ours is some of the best that they've ever had. My name is Rodney Johnson. I'm the general manager here at Fork. At Fork, we uh, feature farm to fork cuisine. You know, it's really hard to pick what our crowd favorite entree here would be at Fork, but most definitely people come back over and over again for the burger. Our flagship cocktail, if we had to pick one, would definitely be the Fork Lemonade. Idaho's local wine selection um, is really surprising to me. I think one of the best things about it is just how unexpected it is to find so many wonderful varietals out here. I am uh, Rémi Courcenet, the food and beverage manager here at the Modern Hotel and Bar. So here we do a lot of craft cocktail, a lot of old uh, vintage classic cocktail variation. So here at the Modern, one of the most popular drinks would be the Lucky Frida. It's for summer season, it's a gin cocktail with some uh, fresh lime, absent, a little bit of mint and egg white and some bitters over the top. Uh, it's a really gorgeous looking drink and refreshing. The season would be the flagship cocktail here at the Modern. We, we change our cocktail program really often. We try to uh, keep our ingredients as fresh as possible. So we're gonna go with the season just like we do with our food. My name is Tara Makalhosi Gurin. I am co-owner of The Bass Market with my husband, Tony. Here at The Bass Market, we specialize in the cuisines of the Iberian Peninsula, specifically the Basque Country and Spain. The Boise culinary scene, I think, is really unique because they really try to draw from all of the influence of the, the cultures and the people of the area. For example, you know, some restaurants will take in items that are Basque, even though they're not a Basque restaurant, but they try to celebrate what is surrounding them. Welcome to Juniper. I'm Casey Montgomery, the owner of Juniper Kitchen and Cocktails here in Boise, Idaho. At Juniper, we specialize in farm to table, regionally sourced, new American cuisine. Uh, our flagship cocktail at Juniper is Juni and the Jets. Uh, honestly, there's you know so much great Idaho wine out there. For us, uh, being a local restaurant, the wine makers uh, are incredible. Um, and they make buying their wine a pleasure. Juniper is everything Idaho. 
If I'm coming into Boise and I don't know anything about it and I'm like, where do I go? Um, if I want to know what's going on in Idaho, then I come to Juniper. My name is David Roberts. I'm the brand manager for Bitter Creek Gale House. We specialize in American pub fare, so we are a, uh, a beer bar foremost for anything else. And so the food that we produce is uh, meant to complement great beer. Um, it's a beer friendly thing, so, you know, um, it, you might best describe it as bar food, but we try to make sure that there's a uh, real thoughtful kind of approach to it. So ethically sourced ingredients that are um, prepared from scratch um, and traditional methods, but always in a way that hopefully contributes something unique to Boise's culinary scene.